Hi folks, I'm going to show you how to start the Honda motors here, the non-electric starts. This will be the same for the 15 or the 20 horse motors. So when they're cold in the morning, you want to grab the fuel line here. You've got the bulb on the fuel line. Just squeeze that a couple times. Get some gas in the motor there. Then when they're cold, we're going to pull the choke out. Choke knob's right here. Pull that out towards you to choke it. I like to pop them into forward one click and back just to know that you're in neutral so we're not trying to start the motor in gear. And then the biggest thing is on the throttle here, there's a little arrow. You want that twisted all the way to the right so it lines up on the start symbol by the turtle. If you twist this up towards the rabbit, the motor will not start. So we want that twisted all the way to the right so it lines up on the start symbol. Then we're going to give it a pull. Just let this warm up for a couple minutes. Then you can push the choke in and you're ready to go. Forward, you pull this towards you, back to neutral, reverse, one click away from you. Uh, lots of adjustments you can do. If you want to change your throttle tension on how tight, just twist the nut right behind it here to tighten or loosen it. And then if you want to adjust the tension on the tiller handle, this lever right here with the black tip. If you slide this to the left, it makes it stiff. Slide it back to the right, it loosens it up. Uh, probably the biggest thing, if you can see it over here, on the very left is your lock and unlock for raising the motor. So right now when it's down, we're in the lock position. Raise that up. It clicks up. That's how you can lift the motor up. Now I can lift it up out of the water if I get in shallow. And when we're running full speed, we want this unlocked as well. That's just a safety issue. That way if you catch a rock or a deadhead, the motor will pop up out of the water and it won't throw you out of the boat. So keep this unlocked. If you're back trolling quite a bit and you give it any kind of gas, it'll pop up. So some people like to lock that down when you're back trolling. Make sure you raise that back up to unlock when you're running full speed. And of course, your kill switch right here. You can wrap this around your wrist, um, attach it to your life jacket. That way, if you get thrown out of the boat, it'll kill it. And then that's also how we can stop the motor. Either pull the clip out or push the red button. And that's it. Hope to see you this summer.